If you're trying to leave Louisiana, whether it's by air or automobile, you better pack your patience. Waiting really was the name of the game today as tens of thousands of people trying to leave the state ahead of Hurricane Ida. We saw on the interstates and highways around the state of Louisiana, people heading north, heading west, heading east, miles and miles and miles of cars, people rushing with their belongings to try and beat the storm. Same story here at the airport, the security line stretching well beyond the normal ropes of where you would start your security. Wait times stretching upwards of 40 minutes at time. Many people I spoke with say they're leaving as quickly as possible. They cut their vacation short. They did not want to risk having to ride out Hurricane Ida right here in New Orleans. Definitely trying to get out because we've been trying to get a way out all day. You couldn't get a rental car, you couldn't get a train ticket or nothing. So we just did get this, this ticket right here. The feeling is pretty like shaky. Like my nerves is bad, but I feel kind of better now because I found a flight, an early flight, because I suppose I left Monday. But you know, the storm, I didn't find out to the storm, about the storm until I got here. So I kind of feel a little bit better now. I'm just ready to get through this line, this long line. But I just hope I make my flight. That's the only thing. Um, if I don't, I don't really know what I'm going to do. So slight panic, but yeah. If you were able to get that last minute flight out of New Orleans, you were one of the lucky ones. Several cancellations on both the departures and arrival boards here into MSY. And for many, again, this was their only option to get out of the city. And many of the people I spoke with say they've never actually been in a hurricane before. They certainly didn't want Hurricane Ida to be their first. In New Orleans, Louisiana, I'm Jonathan Petromala.